welcome back everyone so today in this video i will be sharing the three best custom windows 11 iso that you can try on a low-end pc or any kind of old pc and laptop so if you're interested on windows 11 and you're scared that you will not be getting that kind of performance then you can surely enjoy and try this custom iso so in this video i will be sharing four different machines that are running on a virtual machine and they all have the same configuration and I will be showing you that what kind of usage is being occupied, what kind of applications are running in the background and what kind of process and handles and threads are being occupied by them. So right now I'm on a normal Windows 11 machine and if I show you the performance and the configuration, the so first let me show you that what kind of configuration it has. So the processor is AMD Ryzen 7 57700 and the installed ram is 4 gigabyte and there is not any kind of application installed on this computer now if i bring up the file explorer so you can see without any application is still around 26 gigabyte has been occupied by the windows 11 machine okay and now if i talk about the usage so if i bring up the task manager and go to the performance tab so you can see around 141 processes are running the threads around 15 30 and handles are around 60,000. and this kind of cpu and the memory usage are being occupied and this is a windows 11 general machine without any kind of changes okay now let's move with the first custom iso that we have is the tiny windows 11. now you are seeing the tiny windows 11 machine and if i show you the configuration first so you can see that its processor amd ryzen 75700 installed physical ram is 4 gigabyte and then if i show you the program so you can see here in the pinned section in the recommended you will find a neat and clean page and even if you go and click on all app the most of the application has been debloated okay and now if i bring up the file explorer so here you can see around 46.7 GB free of 63.1 gigabyte. And in compared to Windows 11, it's only occupying around 17 gigabyte of space. So that's quite low. And now if I talk about the utilization, so if I go to the task manager, so you can see the process that were around 140, the thread that was around 16 and 1500, and handle that was around 60,000 so it has been reduced now okay so surely if you have a low-end pc you will be finding a great change but if you talk about my personal recommendation i would only recommend you this for a low-end pc and not for any kind of uh, old laptop or pc that has a very low configuration okay for that you can try the another two iso that i will be sharing okay so now you will be getting an idea that what kind of utilization is being occupied and what kind of disk usage has been occupied and what kind of performance you will be getting on this custom iso okay now let's move with the next one that we have is the revy os the revision windows 11 okay so now we are in the revy os and once you will install it you will be getting this kind of theme and this kind of desktop and wallpaper so first let me show you the system information and you can see the processor is AMD Ryzen 7 570 and physical memory is 4 GB. And this time if you click on the Windows icon, again you will be getting the neat and clean page with a very less bloatware. Okay, now if I bring up the file explorer and here you can see that 50.9 GB that is around 51 GB is free and only around 12 gigabyte is occupied by this revision windows 11 custom iso that is quite low in compared to windows 11 and tiny 11 now let's see about the performance if i bring up the task manager and go to the performance so you can see there is a huge difference now the processes have been reduced to half or i can say more than half because on windows 11 regular it was around 140 and it is only 65 the thread that was around 1600 it's only 800 now the handle which was 60,000 it's only 30,000 and you can see the utilization is below 4% and only CPU usage is 3 to 
the memory only 30 percent so that's quite low if you are running a low-end pc with only 4 gigabyte of ram and this kind of performance really matter and of course you can enjoy the gaming and you can run windows 11 smoothly without any kind of problem and now let me share something more about the revision os and if i bring up their settings so you will find almost everything as it is on windows 11 but there are two different things that are missing from here okay one i can see that windows security will not be working properly here and another option that is missing here is windows update okay so that has been removed and hidden on revy os but the best part is that you can bring it up and you can enable these options so once you will install the Revy OS, you will find a tool by the name Revision Tool on your Revy OS desktop. And once you bring it up, you will find this kind of page. And here in the security section, you can see the Windows Defender has been disabled. The Spectre and the Meltdown mitigation has been disabled. Now if I go to the usability, and here the windows notification, inking, typing, personalization, disable caps lock key. All these options are being disabled so that you can get the best performance. Then you have the windows 11. You get few more options like you can enable or disable the new context menu that you make a right click on your desktop. And this navigation, this look, this context menu you can change from here. Then you have the performance tab where the super fetch, full screen optimization, optimization for windowed game has been disabled. Now windows update, if you want to enable this option, so by default it will be hidden. And once you toggle it off and restart the windows setting, let me bring it up again. So you can see the windows update is back. Okay, so if you want the windows update, you can just enable it from here. And if you want to disable it, then you can disable it from here. So this is another best part of the revision OS because many people, they want to keep it disabled. Many people, they want it. So it's all up to you. Okay, so you will be getting the option over here. Rest, you have seen the utilization, which is very low. And now let's talk about the final customizer that we have. That is Atlas OS. And that is my personal recommendation and my favorite. So now we are in the Atlas Windows 11 OS and here you can see that this kind of wallpaper will be given to you that you can change if you want to. Again, if I go and check the system information, so you can see the same processor and with a 4 GB of RAM with no application has been installed. And now if I bring up the file explorer, so you can see around 44 GB is free of 63.1 GB. That is a little bit more than compared to Revy OS and less than the tiny 11 so that's okay only 19 gigabyte has been occupied now if i talk about their usage so if i bring up the task manager and go to the performance so the process is around 73 the threads are around 1000 handle are around 34000 so again if i compare all the three custom iso the minimum resources was being occupied by the Revy OS, but the Atlas OS is also very close to it with the 74 processes only threads are around 1000 and that is quite good. Now, if I talk about the comparison, so you will be getting all the ISO link in the description. Now, if I talk about the Atlas OS, so here you get two different options. Either you can fresh install Atlas OS with Windows 11 and if you are already on windows 11 then you don't have to clean install it you can upgrade to atlas os by visiting to their website okay so if you are already on windows 11 then you don't have to fresh install it and then you can simply download their software and you can upgrade to atlas operating system in order to reduce the cpu and the ram usage so now after watching all these three custom iso you must have enough idea that what kind of utilization is being done by these custom iso and why you should use it if you want to enjoy windows 11 on a low end pc because as it is occupying a low resources of course you can run on a low end pc and even you can enjoy the gaming on the computer if you want to enjoy games like valorant minecraft or roblox 
so that's all guys for today hopefully you will find these all three custom iso useful and if yes let me know in the comment section that which custom iso you like the most for any kind of doubt or question you can let me know in the comment section till then take care bye bye